Hello, ladies and gents. Welcome to our third and spotlight. This time we're going to talk about Lysius nigea or the black garden ant. This species is commonly found in the entire northern hemisphere. As most ant keepers, Lysius nigea was also my first species to keep. This is because Lysius nigea is a common ant species. They don't require a lot of experience. Thus, it is the best end to begin with. Lacius queens can live for 15 years and can reach sizes up to 40,000 workers. The workers are about 4 mm big and have a glossy black color. They are most easily found on sidewalks, but they are also common in gardens. They can be a pest for gardeners because of their mutualistic relation with aphids. They can easily be kept at room temperature, but the brood develops a lot faster if you heat the nest. The diet consists of insects, fruit and nectar. This colony for about a year, maybe a bit longer. And they're doing great. I'm currently housing them in an ant kit size 4 from Carrium, attached to a test tube with sugar water and a homemade outworld. Most of the ants stay around the queen and brood. These ants are a bit shy in the beginning, but when the colony becomes bigger, they actually become a bit more aggressive. But don't worry, they don't sting. I've kept my colony in a test tube for the first three months. After that, I made a very small grout from Carrium, from a Ferrero Rocher box, you know, the chocolate thingies with hazelnuts. It would just last 10 months. And then, of course, there was a struggle to have them moved into this acrylic from Carrium. But after a long time, finally, as you can see, they moved. So yeah, I'm very happy to finally do this and spotlight. I didn't want to make the ant spotlight with their former nest because it wasn't that really nice to look at, but still quite efficient. Here is the outworld I made. It's also made from one of the smaller boxes from the Good Morgan set. But unfortunately, I'm all out of boxes. So I guess someone's taking a trip to IKEA very soon. One thing I almost forgot to mention the nuptial flights happened in July or August on a hot summer day. This year, in my area, there was a complete swarm of Queen Alates, and it even got in the news, so it was chaos. So this was the end spotlight, cheerio, adios, goodbye, thank you for looking, please subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to like us on Facebook, cheerio.